There is, isn't there? Yeah. It's just the down. But I doubt the control movement because there's much more up than down in reality. Yeah. I think I think it'll be fine. I think, yeah. And obviously that's how it was designed. And we mustn't forget to sort out the business of the um, of the conflict of the cable down here with the rudder pedals to work that one out. cable bracing with the splicing inside the wings at the inboard end and then at the outboard end we've got the piano wire attachment for lighter loads goes out to the tip stick came all the way back from the Dardanelles it's now been incorporated and there's the original rudder bar that came also came back from the Dardanelles Magneto's still at home awaiting the time when we manage to get ourselves an engine so we don't really need for that for just a bit you can see that the no, the controls don't work because the, uh, the stick's jammed on the ground at the bottom there, but it does all it does all go, and it clears the top of the uh, the bottom of the instrument panel, so that's nice to know. Back here is the aft carry through, very very substantial to take all the flying loads. front end that the carry through here which isn't clearly shown on the drawings comes across the top of the heel troughs and uh, so it's clear you're going to kick it with your heel if you apply full rudder so we have to sort that one out but we think we'll probably just raise the heel troughs a little bit. Thank you. And then moving further back two little fair leads for the elevator cables and then the tailplane attachment is very strange the, uh, it, it's an adjustable incidence the uh, tailplane is, is permanently fixed at the back here uh, with bolts and uh, and then it's intended that you adjust the leading edge by means of these adjustable straps here that move things up and down and there are also adjustable struts at the leading edge but what they forgot to do was to allow for an adjustable uh, attachment of the main spar here and uh, so we've had to make a, a small modification so that we can we can put additional holes in uh, to al to uh, to alter the incidence uh, to suit. Because of course, once the fabrics once the uh, fabric is on the tailplane, uh, we won't be able to get access to those brackets. The elevators here are all steel construction, and one of the things that we've established by doing this assembly today is the fact that the amount of down elevator we've got is limited by the rudder horn. Uh, that's the maximum amount of down, it's about 20 degrees. It's probably fine, but it's rather less than we had expected. Uh, all the, the, uh, the tail surfaces are much smaller than you would expect with a modern aircraft. Uh, that rudder 
is actually a medium-sized rudder. Uh, the, the initial one was, was smaller even than that. Uh, and for higher powered engines, they actually uh, then fitted a, a, a bigger rudder still.